All right, here we go. Doom Kid presents Ray Mohawk's Manic Monday. We got Man with Gun, Dark Pulse, and Ori here today. Hello. Hello there. Hello this there. program comes to you pre-recorded. Yeah, I'm seeking validation. Here we go. Map. <laughs> oh three. Yeah. We're getting there. Don't be we scared. We love pollution. I'm, okay. I'm a nice Frenchman. Don't be scared, actually. <laughs> Welcome to the to the to the whatever it is I do here. First time having you on. Oh, I like this funky music going on. Well, let me see if I can hear it properly. Yeah. Ah, yeah. That is that is funky, all right. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> That's a certified. <laughs> it's a certified banger. Oh fuck, they're gonna get me. That's a nice mentation. Yeah, these maps are these maps are pretty fun. All by Doom Kid, Ray Mohawk. Six yeah, maps. He's a fuck. pretty good mapper on the whole. I do like his map style. Oh, the hit scanners though will fuck you up. Yeah, well, be careful. Different. You're already starting to get a little low. It Doom sure kid. looks vanilla. Doom Kid, it is vanilla, actually. Well, I know for sure. I mean, come on, it's Doom Kid. Does he <laughs> any time making not non vanilla? I don't um, think so. He said he has made some Z Doom maps in the past. I can't Z even picture. G I can't picture him doing like a crazy elaborate ZZ Doom map with all the effects and shit. I mean, I don't, I don't know if he'll ever go to that level. He's. Still I remember a time when I actually first time well. Search for, uh, for some boss to play, and I first time saw Clippy, and uh, he posted like some level I don't remember it's called, like gas station. I don't, don't remember at all. I I was at the uh, gas but... station. Down here. It 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 gas somewhat called. I don't remember exactly. The name. I'm trying to but... think. Uh, I'm trying to remember something about a gas station. Wasn't it like that one uh, legacy uh, wad? With all the Doom cute, uh, with the city buildings and everything, perhaps. I don't remember ever being at a gas station. Well, anyway... Um, You've done a lot, Clippy, so... I, I just do remember the description of it. It's called, like, Vanilla Compatible. Hey, what's up? Shit. Oh, Sandwich! Uh, How's she going? Sandwich. Wild Sandwich yeah. appears. Good. No sandwich. We're not, we're not live today. We're just doing a... Whatever yeah, this is. The video. So the I tried map. to play this in vanilla and it's not working. I was kind of like, what the fuck? What do you mean this... by vanilla? This right here? No. Just uh, going about the first po uh, post I saw from you. Oh, yeah. When I first started, I didn't know what the hell I was doing mapping wise. I. Yeah, you've been calling like vanilla maps. Uh, even they actually made in G's Doom. Yeah, I didn't quite understand the linguo, so I told people it was vanilla maps, and they weren't even remotely. I, I hate when people actually calling vanilla just, uh, you know, maps without mods. I used to do that, but I wasn't very educated. I didn't know what I was talking about. And then I signed up to make a vanilla map for the modest mapping competition, and I had to drop out because I couldn't do it. I'm like, yeah, oh, I mean, shit, I can is... see that mistake when you're <laughs> not so versed in the community and don't realize the term has a very specific meaning just yet. I'll do limit yeah. removing at best. I can't handle the... But that too crazy, man. Viz planes, draw like... eggs, and this, that, and the other thing. It's, no, it it's not like... Uh, I gotta say, though, it's not like uh, we are seeing less and less uh, classic world and community projects using uh, Vanilla Doom specifically. We, mm, oh my uh, god. We, all, we often see uh, maps done uh, with limit removing engine search as a uh, boom oh and my everything god. because. Oh, it's I less, walked into uh, it. What the hell happened to me? Oh, yeah. You <laughs> walked right into its fireball. I like, transformed into a. It, and then you moved back into it as it was moving just past you. I'm gonna kill myself on purpose because something weird happened with my sprite. Oh, damn it. No, it's not. It's just a Doom Guy replacement so uh, sprite. What? Yeah. Yeah, Mortal Kombat 3. And yeah, Mortal Kombat screen. Oh, yeah. shit! <laughs> I'm a full on Ray Mohawk guy. Except for on the display bar, I have a green thing. And up there, I have a red Mohawk. Okay. So weird to Probably use this sprite for. I wonder if that's, guy. yeah, like a team color thing. I don't know. <laughs> that's my first death that, in these yeah. maps, by the way, I think. Map He's on map three. <laughs> of six, yeah. Well, so speaking of vanilla, I mean, just look at this map. There's nothing really much fancy going on. That, that's why yeah. it's compatible with it. I mean, oh, 
keep in mind for vanilla limits it, like yeah it's hard as fuck but if you're making something you know really simple it's not big of a deal it's it's not fancy but it's very clean and i actually kind of like that in my maps like I, I know you've heard me say it before, Man With Gun, but like one of the things I really can't stand is when people just put in more detail because they can, when I'd rather they spend that time on like improving the map flow or, you know, working on the placement of things or whatever. Because detail is one of those things where it's nice to look at, but it doesn't really add anything once you get to a certain point of it. I would say I'm a little bit guilty of that. <laughs> I'm I mean, trying to improve there, on there's, that. There's but... a fine level between when you're adding detail to make it look good and to the point where you're being like absolutely pedantic about this thing trying to resemble something fancy. And, yeah, like know. who would use like 50,000 line depths in a map or something like that? That would be yeah. ridiculous. Like uh, old time community members like might actually gun. remember um, Gothic 99 and Gothic DM were like absolutely getting brutally savaged when those came out because like they could not run well on computers of the time at all this was an era where like pentium threes were king and we're still struggling to run those maps well weren't those terrible to play too or at least the second one um i've never played them so honestly like, I'm, I'm not gonna speak to them maybe we i'm can pretty get... sure i heard that like gothic dm maybe two or one of them like looked really good but were actually terrible to play in deathmatch yeah i mean just focused on that maybe so, yeah. one of these days we could have Doom Kid throw it up on one of his Doom Shack servers for a lark and you know play through them and give a community a sand sandstream community assessment. I think it would yeah, be I interesting think... to uh, to play the the maps uh, Gothic DM and everything uh, with modern specs to see if they still hold up and the frame rate is somehow. Oh, I'd imagine on a, on a computer even from ten years ago they'd be no problem now. I mean, they're detailed, but they're not like that detailed. I don't remember I. Um, call one theory of mine um, that you, there is really hard to make a good detail and good gameplay at once. You always need to sacrifice for some specific result you want to take. Well, you know? I think I think detail can add quite a bit. I think Man with Guns a perfect example. Like yeah. your, your maps, but obviously they're also fun to play. So it's right, and, and his is yeah. right about at that sweet spot just... where it's detailed. It looks nice, but he's not throwing down stuff. You know, that's like just absolutely pedantic and getting. I mean, play. I, I, I really say like thanks, but <laughs> I, I definitely appreciate this kind of opinion on my maps because gameplay is one of the most fucking hard things for me to learn. Like gameplay Doom sometimes so fucking primitive so you can place a bunch of fucking random monsters and call it day we're, we're like, just a bunch of cavemen not... playing doom really i mean <laughs> we're very primitive it, it's not we really like we a shoot demon Ugh like... makes shotgun go boom <laughs> no i mean, I mean it's it's great. not like a gameplay on modern turn you know what i mean yeah. Oh, I know. It's uh, it's such it's a it's such anymore. a distillation of like the shooter experience. Like just just point and shoot at the demons. Like I, I love that about it. I mean, you could always also have like a, a dev strat where you actually have two teams working on the ward. One is doing the flow of the level, and the other team is actually working on the details and everything. But surely that would take too much time for a single level ward or mega ward something. That's an interesting yeah. way to split it up. I haven't really thought about that before. Because I mean, there are some people that are really great at doing like the detail, but their you know gameplay flow sucks. And there's some people that are absolute kings of gameplay, but you know without them the levels basically look like bare boxes. So I suck at detail, so it'd be nice to get somebody to like detail my maps for me. I just focus on gameplay. <laughs> oh, I'm serious. If you could rent a detailer out on like Fiverr or something, you know I'd do it. Rent a detail. <laughs> Go to a car you know, you, <laughs> hey Clippy, do you remember the fucking texture you got on your texture pack? Like, uh, get your ad. Yeah, there's all sorts of weird shit in there. Yeah, and I think call this actually... number. Like, call men with gun. <laughs> You'll detail your map. <laughs> <laughs> man with gun's a consultant. We'll yeah. detail for frags. I would do something like that for my uh, custom version of 24 and 15. Like, a if I can win sandwich in DM, I'll be happy. But seriously, sandwich is so fucking hard to kill. I love when the plays you fall both off. are hard to kill. I don't know how I am, but sandwich is just 
like my head's just a bit shaking when I get close. To me. <laughs> I'm glad. Good to know that I make your head shake in death. <laughs> I don't shake. I just don't get lucky with the spreads. Either that you, or you I'm just like, like you off. never lose your shots on SSG. Never. Like yeah, uh, fucking. It feels different on my end, but yeah, maybe relatively. I don't know I how. A lot of doom, folks. I I don't know how pellets actually you know lands on certain ping, but for me it's quite random. It is hey. random, but with a with high ping it's even more random, I think. Clippy, how you how you finding uh, Ray Mohawk with all the new enemies and stuff? I'm having a great yeah. time. I want to play the yeah. second one too. That one goes a lot crazier too. Yeah, yeah because it's a community project. Oh, it's yeah. not just Doom Kid. Oh, well that changes things. I really like Doom Kid style, so I was hoping to play another full set of maps exclusively by Doom Kid. I think you yeah. might have done one or two of them, but yeah. Well, also the D-hack just goes way crazier than this, right? But, yeah. Uh, well, Ro gone, Ray right? Mohawk, uh, Mohawk, I, I mean... Mohawk? <laughs> I don't know Ray how to Mayhoke. pronounce it. Mayhoke. <laughs> Mohawk. Roy... Ray <laughs> Hockey. Uh, uh, I don't know if this version of, uh, of Ray Mohawk 2 uh, actually has custom textures alongside the... Uh, the act files actually because um, actually I'm... a good friend of mine participated in second uh, rainbow hog so <laughs> would be cool to see if you actually get a because player. It... when i first saw the uh, the announcement for rainbow Rogue, that was like uh, a few months before the uh, announcement for uh, rowdy uh, no, not a Rowdy Rowdy, but the, uh... Rowdy, what was it Rowdy. called already? The Jamal project Jones, the end of the end of... Yes, Jamal Jones. Oh, yeah. It's a few months before Jamal Jones actually had... Uh, I, uh, we had the, the proof of concept with the first few levels and... It, I'm trying to... I think there was actually custom textures and everything, if I remember correctly. In, in Mohawk 2 or in... Uh... Yes, in Mohawk <laughs> 2 actually. I... I think so. You played this I... sandwich? Yeah, I played this a while ago. Where's the other secret, bud? Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, too long, too long ago for that. You gotta remember friend. all the secrets and all the maps you played, right? I'm, I'm not sure I even got. I found them all in this one. All right, I guess we're not gonna UV max it. Unless Doom well, Kid makes the, an appearance and the, tells me where it is. Look at the auto map. Is there any hints? Did you get Gray the... shit. Yeah. No, I don't have an actual map. Sure does. Okay. I'm sure that there is a wall that is like brighter than the rest or something. Do you guys see anything of entry here? No. I mean, there's the one purple area, but I think that's the one you found. I found that one. Yeah, I definitely found that one. Was it at the beginning, I think. Why does it have like a weird we line there? Map three, we love pollution. Wow. Yeah. It's a, it's a an equation with the, uh, the theme of the of the ward and everything, the story with the the UAC putting so oh, much the window. turns yeah. California into a mutant state and everything. Yeah, yeah, I like it. He has fun little stories. I think we're done. I'm just looking around for a second. But yeah, I, I like this map. The hit scanners, though, almost got me. But yeah, he uh, he likes his hit scanners and his new his new hit scan skins and everything. But I, I like I like crushing hordes of squishy boys. Yeah, look at this. I love the atmosphere, the vacations, the trees, the skies. I gotta go. How do I leave? <laughs> I, I gotta say, the, the, the music also solves the, the level well because sometimes when you have like uh, decent maps and everything, when you use properly uh, fitting music, it really uh, ups up uh, the uh, experience even more, actually, in my opinion. I mean, <laughs> uh, yeah, something like that. Uh, Including this music. I always forget yeah. about that. Yeah. That's pretty funny. I mean, would Mega Wads like uh, Alien Vendetta and uh, Sunlust be uh, as iconic as uh, they are without the soundtrack? Yeah, music adds a lot, I agree. Absolutely. I suck at music. Yeah, atmosphere. I need to get an interior decorator for my maps and a fucking, like, musician or something. like. A DJ? <laughs> I just want to make the map, place the monsters, and then somebody else detail it. That'd be ideal. Clippy, it's just... kind of funny to hear 
this from you because you're playing so much shit. Like, you never actually heard a pretty midi besides the fucking Rise of the Triad? I, I don't think there's any other songs really out there besides Jimmy Tunes and, you know, Rise of the Triad, <laughs> is there? It's not about all Jimmy. There's Earth Falling, <laughs> fucking oh, Jimmy. Mark Clem. Oh, Jimmy. Mark Clem. Yes. Jesus, no, like, I would so say many fucking I composers. Know. I want to do I a mashup with a Rise of the Triad song and a Jimmy song and put them together and that'll be my next <laughs> map. Gun is gonna do you even he heard me? <laughs> <laughs> or are you just ignoring me? Just commission Jimmy. <laughs> He's trying just, to troll you. Oh, oh, you mean Jimmy? Jimmy yeah, I, I love using Jimmy's MIDI. Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy is all almighty god. Ignore the rest, actually. Yeah. Alright, I think we're going to stop the video. Happy birthday, Love and Dead, by the way, and thanks for coming Happy along, Happy birthday, you guys. Love and Dead. Yeah. Why, thank you. Mm. All right. You're not so dead. I might, I might stream on Thanksgiving Thursday, Zone 300, maybe, by the way. Alright, I'm out. I'll not come back.